Your next topic is Lewis structure for molecules having multiple covalent bonds. Okay, so uh, if uh, normal uh, valence of an uh, atom is uh, not satisfied by sharing single electron pair between atoms, the atom may share more than one electron pair between them. Okay, so in that case, if two atoms share one electron pair then the bond is known as a single bond okay then the bond is single bond okay and uh, it is uh, denoted by a single dash like this okay and uh, if two atoms combine or you can say share two uh, electron pairs then the bond is double bond and it is denoted by a double dash similarly if it has uh, shares if it shares uh, three uh, electron pairs if the atoms two atoms share three electron pairs then in that case it is a triple bond which is shown by a three dash okay so let's uh, see how it goes okay uh, we had studied in the earlier video uh, the formation of the hydrogen molecule in uh, which the hydrogen was uh, bonded through a single bond that is why a single dash will be uh, shown in that case uh, now let's uh, consider about this oxygen molecule oxygen has six electrons in its outermost shell okay when it will combine with the second oxygen atom the second oxygen atom will also have six electrons in its outermost shell it means that this atom needs two electrons and this oxygen atom also needs two electrons okay so both of them will share their two electron pairs okay so if uh, in that case it will be shared between them like this okay, this will share its two electron and this atom will also share its two electron okay so you can count it here 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 and 8 and here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and 8 okay so there are you can see that two electron pairs are being shared by these two atoms so it will have a double bond between them okay so this is how we show it uh, next let's uh, move to a triple bond uh, for example uh, this nitrogen atom nitrogen has seven electrons in its outermost shell sorry it's not uh, it does not have uh, seven electrons it has uh, five electrons in its outermost shell Similarly, this nitrogen atom will also have five electrons in its outermost shell. When they will combine, they will combine like this. Uh, for showing this. Uh, we have to just uh, put the three electrons in uh, a proper line so first of all let's put the three electrons this is not the correct way this is the correct way to show it okay so for this uh, we put the three electrons here and the rest of two here okay so this atom will share its three electron and this atom will also share its three electron of the other and as you can see that three electron pairs are being shared between these two atoms then it will form a triple bond okay so this is how we show the formation of multiple bonds in